Hello, hello everyone, and welcome back to Thrifting Thursday. This is Nancy, and I wanted to show you that the uh, area rug that I picked up from the yard sale last week, this is where I ended up putting it. I thought that the red color in the rug and the red color in the sofa really helped to pull everything together. So that is where I used that. I did go to a couple of Goodwills this week, and sometimes you walk in and it is just full of treasures, and sometimes you walk in and you walk out empty-handed, and that's just really the way that it goes. But I did wanna show you one thing that I picked up. I saw this blanket, and I love the color, this, this good taupe, which is a good neutral color. And then, of course, I felt of it. It just felt wonderful. And then the next thing I usually do is see if I can find a maker. And lo and behold, Mary Kay. We all recognize Mary Kay. I had no idea that they made uh, throws, but I picked this up for 99 cents. And even though I don't need another blanket, this was just such a good buy that I wasn't going to leave it behind, so it had to come home with me. I did find these solar lights for our pool, and as you can see, you can set them in the water. We have an above-ground pool. Cameron and I just enjoy it. It's not, it's not that big, but it's something that we enjoy, and you can set these um, on these little uh, plastic landing things right here. But you can also hang them. So I had gotten uh, four of these all together for $10 total. And I decided that it would work out better for us if we had them hanging. And I really wasn't sure what I was going to use, but I did find something. To our local Dollar Tree, and lo and behold, they had the perfect little stands. Of course, they were a dollar twenty-five piece. So I ended up putting these out in this area, um, going into the pool, and they do look really cool at night. And I did make some uh, video footage of this for you, but I was able to get these lights plus the poles to hang them for $15. So I think I did pretty good on that. And then here is the video at how they look at night. This is a video of the lights at night and I had the choice I could either put them on a base and let them float in the pool, but I found the, these little hangers at the Dollar Tree for $1.25, and they were just perfect for this. So I decided that it would be cute to have these little green pool lights back here, because I do like to sort of light it up in the back at night. We sit back here and uh, Cameron and I do a lot of swimming at night. We both um, are so sensitive to the sun and he takes a, a medication that makes him even more sensitive. So we sit back here a lot and I think we're gonna add even some more lights to the pool area, but I thought those were cute for $10. The next item that I've gotten this week that I'm really excited about are these little uh, pots. And what's so cool about these, there's six in them, there's six pots per bundle. No, I'm sorry, yeah, they're three inch, there's six per bundle. And a friend of mine actually gave these to me. But what is so nice about these is when you pot in these, when you start your seeds in these, you actually plant these directly into the ground. So plants that don't like their roots disturbed, this is just excellent. So I am so thrilled to have all of these little pots. Turn it upside down so you can see. 
And thank you so much to Leslie. I appreciate these pots. Can't wait to use them. The final item that I want to show you this week that I happened to find, um, I'm not a big drinker, but I do like to have things on hand in case somebody, you know, asks for something. So I was at our local IGA, which is owned by Houchins, and I've never heard of this brand, never had this, but it's a hard seltzer. And what I noticed is that it was $3.50 when it was normally like $14.50. So I went ahead, picked up um, a couple of cases of these because I thought, you know, we'll have it on hand and if somebody wants something this summer, then we'll have that. And I've, I've restocked for $7. I don't think you can beat that. Now you may wonder, why does she work so hard to save money? It's so I can buy chickens, y'all. That's the whole reason. Obviously, I'm joking, but I'm kind of not. So, a friend of mine, Junior and Sheila, that you often see, they have chickens that lay different color eggs. Now, my chickens, um, they are just brown eggers, just plain brown eggers. But I went into Tractor Supply yesterday and came out with three starlight green eggers which lay green eggs and cream leg bar which lay blue eggs so now i have these little babies and i'll put pictures up of what they'll look like when they're grown but i was just thrilled to death to be able to find these little chickens and then here are the isa browns that I got. I think these are going on a month old. So these are doing really good. They lay, uh, they're a good egg layer. They usually lay around 300 eggs a year. So I'm actually splitting these with a friend of mine. These aren't all mine. And then this is the rest of the girls. And you see this big roo right here. This is Sir Richard. And I am not allowed to have roosters in the city, so he is going to go to another home. But I am enjoying him, and as you can see, he's a little cross-beaked rooster, so his crow isn't very loud. It's not as loud as a typical rooster would be, but he is the sweetest rooster, and I just enjoy hearing him. But it's not allowed so this is the flock for now uh, i'm gonna send sir richard's favorite hen with him to keep him company so these will um it's actually the one that's moving around right there the one with the with the black collar that's his favorite gal so she's gonna go with him but this is what's happening in the chicken coop and I appreciate everyone for watching. I hope that you have had a good week thrifting, finding uh, good treasures and having fun, doing your projects and saving money. And I appreciate everyone for watching and I will see you this Sunday with a gardening video. Have a great week.